a Fox Sticks tubal cane here. I don't have too much to say, just too busy and status quo apparently in the world around us. I haven't seen much change, as I said, in probably 30 years with looking into conspiracies and Illuminati. Shit don't seem to change. But what brings me here today is one thing on my mind is the bullshit that's starting to just add up in front of me on TV and on the radio with the advertisement and marketing. If that is what is to drive the economy, is what is being thrown at me in the advertising and marketing scene, we're in trouble. Well, we know we are anyways, but it seems like the media trying to drive the economy is wanting us to support local artists. But these local artists are either craft brewers or food eateries. For some reason, that's where they seem to want to promote and drive us to to take our hard-earned money. And when I think about it in the simplest way, food and alcohol are things that we just ingest to shit and piss out later, ultimately. So for someone trying to disguise the way or change the way I ingest things to make it seem like it's art, I don't buy that one either. That's not art. That's just someone feels it's like going to a gas station to fuel up your car, ultimately, in the simplest terms. So the idea of how someone dresses it up for me to ingest so I can just piss and shit it out later, that's not art. And it's no reason to have to continuously open up new places, new craft breweries, new eateries with some little different little twist that the local media will flood you with to get you to spend your hard-earned money at. <clears throat> Instead of maybe saving it for that rainy day and just eating things you need, not what you want. And again, it's about the control of your passions and desires. So just that's one of the things on my mind. If you as people who are not into the status quo and the way that it is progressing, rolling out. Do not support craft brewers or new eateries with their fancy little twist. Support your friends who like to craft brew at home and exchange your likes with them. Or if you want, buy a six pack from a friend of yours to support his artistry, but the idea that capitalism only will survive if we, as the slaves, take our hard-earned money and go spend it on a different flavored beer or a different flavored steak, beef, chicken, vegetable, vegan, non-fat, blah, blah, all of that little literary narrative about how great and special this certain beer may be or this certain food may be is to literally lull us to sleep, make us go out and want it so we can just shit or piss it out later as waste. So do your part. Stop supporting the local businesses that your media tells you to support. And two, the whole idea of people buying jewelry that diamonds, rubies, emeralds, silver, platinum, gold, that that has any value for us to wear. What for? Again, who benefits? Follow the money. So the idea that us slaves should spend money on stones or precious metals that we have to wear is bullshit. That's another ruse that was put forth by the European elite and who they come from they've always wanted it. They've had wars over golds and diamonds. They have killed other humans, brothers and sisters, over these possessions. So do not support jewelry. Do not support your local fine food establishments that your local media is pushing. Just someone in your particular neighborhood that needs your support. And the craft brewers your friends who do it, support them, not the business that your media is telling you to support. So fuck sticks, do your part, save your money, and don't spend it on who the media tells you to. 
Flatlines matter. Peace.